sometimes social media can be seen by others as just having fun. And sometimes emerging technology can be really intimidating, like it's a lot of tech stuff, right? But using it for good, the way that I see social media and technology is that it's a conversation. And social media is the conversation that you want to have and you want to find other people that share the same passion, vision, and values as you do. And technology is an enabler, right? If you're doing good, it can multiply that goodness by three to five times. Think of it as an online community that you need to put your message out there to start to attract your tribe and find them. And social media and technology is going to be the fastest way for you to be able to reach them. You know, I'll give you an example. So when I launched Mo Women Take on the World, I had this young girl reach out to me and she said, Elizabeth, I want to become a doctor. But in my small town here, I feel like my family and my community doesn't support me. And I don't know how to become a doctor. Do you know anybody that I could talk to just to hear about how they became a doctor? How do they pay for school? What did they do? And I said, yes, I do. Let me introduce you to a Hmong woman doctor in Minnesota and another Hmong woman doctor in Australia, right? And so I made the introductions for her just so that she could be able to talk to them and hear and listen about how they did it. And that's the beauty of social media and technology is that you're able to reach people that are really outside of your world that you probably don't have access to, that you don't even know existed. So social media and technology can be used for good. It's really about having a conversation so that you can attract people that really share your passion and vision with you.